Well, hello, peeps. Good morning. Welcome back. So, um, it was my birthday the other day, and my uh, my husband, love him, he uh, he got me an orchid, <laughs> and it's it's just a, a normal fowl, nothing um, particularly unusual or different from what I've got and what I've shown you on this channel before. But there is a little bit of a difference, and I don't know if you, you can see that it's got um, a blue hue to it. Let's see if I can get a um, good shot. You can probably see it better at the back here. So you can see here it's blue. Um, and you may or may not know that... Um, yeah, this this is lies. This is all lies. Um, my husband didn't realise it. He were, he just he said he wanted to get me something. He wanted to get me a plant, and um, he was looking at uh, succulents because he was adamant I wasn't getting another orchid. <laughs> but he was just so enchanted uh, by the blue hue to this orchid, and yeah, you see, wonder of nature, blue. Wonder of uh, lies, wonder of bullshit, but never mind. Uh, <laughs> and he was just so um, enchanted by it and he had to get it. So when I explained to him um, that it was really not real, that this blue was um, just artificial, he was, he was quite um, disappointed. So I decided to make this video to, to basically yeah, ex explain this practice in case you're not aware of it and in case um, someone's partner or someone buys an orchid and feels duped afterwards when they find out. So so this is a little bit of a, an informative uh, video on that process and practice. So basically what they do um, is they inject uh, food colouring um, somewhere into, you can see here, Actually, that's where they've done it where that little blue spot is there and they kind of just get some blue food coloring and inject it into the spike and what it does is it's absorbed and you know it's taken in and the flowers take on this blue hue and it starts to look a little bit washed out of course it's a it's a little bit more stronger when you first do it depending on how much you put in but eventually the more water it takes up the more it washes out and then eventually when the the flowers drop um that's it you know unless you you do the food coloring again um what you'll get is just the normal flower colors which in this case is it looks like it's white with these uh purple veins and a bit of a yellow center and you can see here that's where it's taken on the blue and yeah, unfortunately, people do think, especially with packaging like this, lies, ooh, lies, don't do this. So, <laughs> well, if you if you like this thing, I guess you can do it if you don't mind doing it, but I personally don't like it, you know. Um, orchids are so beautiful as they are, you know, why, why fuck with it? There is no such thing as a blue orchid, so deal with it, basically. So... <sighs> Yeah, they, they, they do this and they, they package it and people buy into it and then once the flowers come back and there's no more blue, they're, they're a little bit disappointed. So, um, yeah, I, I personally find it a shame that they do this. I, I really do. I, I mean, I don't know. Some people like it. Let me know what you think, you know, uh, makes for an interesting discussion. Do you uh, enjoy um plants that are, are artificially colored or painted or or do you do it yourself does this interest you or are you just dead against it let me know i'm interested so um yeah that, that pretty much covers it for for this orchid and here he is i'll just uh get that so you can see and he's in a pretty decorative pot there so yeah that's that's my newest orchid um hasn't yet got a name there we go. Anyway, peeps, thanks for watching. Um, as always, it's much appreciated. Much love. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye.